Be the little eyes. Those dead beady eyes. What? Say that again. You can't get in touch with Lord Crop. You're correct, sir. We are investigating now. We should hear any time. Sir Grotus, please allow me to enter. Yes, what is it? I have a report, sir. The Crystal Star is in the Boggly Woods. Has apparently been taken by Mario. What? You must be joking. <laughs> what about Lord Crump and the Shadow Sirens? I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, Mario laid a beating on all of them. Mm, disturbing. This Mario character. What kind of... Speak up, x -Nub. What is the status of the other Crystal Stars? I apologize, sir. We are still searching for the other Crystal Stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. We knew of three of them. Hooktail Castle, Boggly Woods, and the one we got in Roadport. That means there are four crystal stars left out there. And we will have them. Keep looking so that Mario won't beat us to the punch. Yes, sir. As I suspected, there is no reason to doubt that Mario has the map. He must. Listen up, you! I want you to keep a close catch on what Mario does from now on. Absolutely, sir. I will install a webcam in his hat. <laughs> we will see what he sees. Mario, I loathe you. I know. Lots of people do. <laughs> they did do. <laughs> oh, Mario, did you even read the mail I sent you? I wonder. I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone is doing at the castle. Will I ever dance at the mushroom ball again? No! What will become of me? With your help, I know. Or care. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sir Reginald, and welcome back to some more Paper Mario Thousand Year Door Dope. Oh boy. Oh, is this text doing again? No, the place is haunted. I'm a ghost hunter now. Let's go find it. <laughs> the sound it makes. Oh yeah, I was using Texas Peach for him. Hello, Princess Peach. I am glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario, did it reach him all right? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Well, good. So what do you want from me today? Is there more you want to know of love? You expressed regret earlier that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? Excuse me? Were you eavesdropping? I am sorry. Princess Peach, I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But, it is odd. When you said that, I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPU would produce this impulse is inexplicable. I must find what caused it. I know what caused it. There's no reason behind such a feeling type. Wanted to do something together. It's part of love. I know it. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Princess Peach, please dance with me. Reggie. You what? Wait, wait just a minute. What am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance? It's just so bizarre. I mean, how in the world could I dance with you? You have no arms or feet or moves. What? He wants to know what love is. Oh, that's too bad. Hmm. <laughs> Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? Oh. Oh my goodness, is that me? Did you create that? Oh, alright, I guess. I must say, though, it's going to feel weird dancing with myself. Press the buttons as they play on the screen. Okie dokie. Do you know how many times I messed this up on purpose? I tried doing this on a Switch controller. <laughs> <laughs> See? Don't worry, that flailing is all part of the dance. <laughs> <laughs> it's, all, it's all part of the love, Tech. 
<laughs> I bet he watches you shower. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm just saying. He's been ordered to surveillance her. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Fucking hell. Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun. Is this impulse I feel the concept known as fun? Tech, are you okay? Princess Peach, I will fulfill my promise to you. Please use my communicator. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. I'm finished, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from this dance immediately. The data that I thought was fun. You're a weird computer. No, you are mistaken. I am the world's best and only perfect computer. Good night, Princess Peach. I'm gonna have to type up a storm for him. <laughs> yes, you are. Uh, I did it last time I could do it this time. Yes, I would. I'm not dancing again because, well, I sucked at it. <laughs> <laughs> and the, the, the flailing was all part of the dance. <laughs> I called this one the rest of Psych Syndrome. <laughs> oh boy, what the hell do these two want? I'm pretty sure it's just up ahead here. <clears throat> Alright, as usual, blood boozer. We just got word that Princess Patch was spotted in the town up ahead. Good, yes, pretty good. Then I'm off. These fools won't know what's coming. My lord, you're so super. Speaking of which... Oh boy. Oh boy. Time for the concept that probably inspired a different kind of game going on here. Get the hell away from me, bastard. I want my... Oh boy. I don't need pipes. Oh, my mushroom. Oh dear. Oh god, it's happening. Oh boy. <laughs> Bitch. Uh, Houston, we got a problem here. I'm too big for this castle. I'm bigger than it. <laughs> My god, he shrank. Oh hey, welcome to Pedalburg and... Ah! Hide everybody, hide! See ya! They're not that scary looking. I know, they're stupid looking. <laughs> what it was. Yes, hide chickens! I have no need for any of you. What I do need though is Princess Peach. Now, uh, where is she? Tell me this instant. Lord Boozer, over there. Yes, I'm gonna call him Boozer because he's a jet gay. Bingo, Princess Peach. Man, that was easy. I found you, my princess. I Bowser the Mighty Krupa King. <laughs> Offer my greeting. Ah, uh, yes, of course. No, 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 that silent treatment. You're coming to my castle with me. Clearly, she's so overcome with joy that she's been that speechless. Look at her. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. Bitch. Oh, uh huh. Sure. I see, I see. How refined. How elegant. Awesome! <laughs> I suppose I could live with a silent princess. Might even have its perch, you know. You know what? No! My, my life's treasure. I'd rather die than give up my life-size patch poster. People sell those? <laughs> you were talking to artwork. I'll start! <laughs> oh my goodness me, didn't see that coming. Great, just great. Now it looks like the huge mighty king of guys who talked to posters! Like a dumbass. <laughs> Doody -doo -doo. Well, yes, I would. Fantastic. I <clears throat> the happy Mario was there to see that. He would never let you live it down! Look at that bonehead. 
So he's gotten that damn thing. Oh my lord, look at all of them here. They're here to say goodbye to their papa. Too bad. Uh, thank you, Mario, for everything you've done. We can go back to our peaceful way of life now. You know, son, now that we get rid right down to it, I'm kind of sad to see you go. I do love pontificating, so come on by whenever you want to sit and chat a while. Yes, please come back and visit. We'll watch for you. That's creepy. We'll work together from now on to prevent anything like that from happening again. Thanks for showing us how to stick together, Mario. Good luck with the crystal stars and each and every last one of you. Please get yourself a soul. <laughs> well, I'm sure we'll be back again at some point. Yeah, definitely. Take care, guys. See you, Mr. Mario. Yeah, yeah you bastards. Goodbye, Mario. <laughs> Mario. Thank God I wouldn't have to read for any old crazy quotes anymore. Not for a while, at least. I know. Maybe I'll give him a super grubbly voice. Oh boy. Hey, did you hear that? Someone's mailing you! I don't care. Dear Mario, I'm sure you're very concerned about me. <laughs> well, let's not get carried away here. <laughs> but please know I'm fine. I'm actually more worried about you. Too bad. I just killed a robot. With a bunch of gas inside of it. The fiends who kidnapped me are searching desperately for the crystal stars. I'll try to learn what I can about them. I'll email again if I uncover anything, okay? You must know I miss you. Lately I've dreamt about our days back in the castle. I hope we'll spend carefree days there again soon, Princess Patch. Oh, isn't that sweet, Mario? Yeah. Alright, time to go. Aw, a coked out princess likes nope. Mario. I think we're just gonna cut back in at the uh, thousand year door. Yep, sounds good. Yay. No oh boy. We're back to get us some more determination. You know what? The next time I see some water. You like it and you know it. I'm gonna jump in there head first. And she's gonna follow me. Here we go, gang Mario. Let's see with that crystal star. Let's see. Yeah. Some dank meth. Yeah. Some dank determination. Oh dear. She's got a double whammy. I know what I'm doing. Dying? Crash or because splash, make, ladies and gentlemen. Because we make this joke every time we're here. <laughs> you know I can't move and do anything about it. <laughs> it's like, got him. <laughs> right where we want him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm staying away from that pedestal. Where's it going to take me? Uh -huh. Yes! My favorite level! Okay, how the fuck am I supposed to get up there? <laughs> Very carefully. I better start building my ladder. <laughs> Gonna build a ladder. That's it. We're going to space. The location of a crystal star has been recorded on a magical map. What makes it magic? Don't ask me. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is! The resting spot of the next crystal star. Totally awesome! But it looks like it's pointing somewhere up in the sky, huh? What would that? What could that mean? Mm, I don't know. Don't ask me. Frankly, I don't give a damn. Oh, frankly, my dear, I don't give a shit. That means that beneath this town, the Thousand Door rolled ruins and rain and tech. Beep. Beep. And that door's been sealed shut for a thousand years by the crystal stars. In order to open that seal, we have to muster the power of all the crystal stars, you bastard. But the question is, why do they seal the legendary treasure away to begin with? Because they don't want anyone else to have it. I mean, were they just trying to keep it from being stolen, or what? No, that's not... What? What's not what? I don't know! Fantastic. Jeez, Professor. I'm sorry, so sorry. I know that the treasure was sealed away around the time the town was being destroyed. But the problem is, no one's even sure what it was that was caused the town's demise. Bunch of heathens, probably. All that's written in this darkness stole the sky, and the uh, cook lives from rain down, and Rainbow stole someone's candy. I must research this more, assuming it will just make an. You know, well, uh, you know the saying. No, I don't, but whatever. 
How about this next crystal star, then? Uh, it's like it's floating on the magical map. Mm, very interesting. Perhaps it's pointing to the floating town of Goodsville. There's a stunning arena there, where great warriors engage in furious battles. Yes, families go there on vacation, allow you to enjoy the fights, but I do not know how to say that word. Ostensibly. Yes. Ostensibly. <laughs> you know, these words are scaring me. <laughs> They're too big. That sentence had too many syllables. Apologize! <laughs> Behind the scenes, the richest people in the world wager on the bounce. It's like floating. Well, how are we supposed to get there then? Very carefully. A special blimp flies there. Fuck! There goes my ladder plan. It departs for roadport several times a day. In and out, in and out. The problem is getting a seat. The only way to get. <laughs> Doing this voice makes me yawn. The only way to get a ticket is through certain channels. What what channels? Stop being mysterious. How do we get seats on the ship? I don't know. I guess we just don't have much choice. Very carefully. Word on the street is all the tickets go through to Don Pianto on the west side. Head west from Mogport's main plaza and you'll reach the west side of town. That part of town is under the control of Don Pianto, the Pianto Syndicate head. Indeed, it sounds nice. Apparently, Don Pianto makes pretty regular jaunts over to Glitzville. So, no problem, we'll just go meet this Don Pianto guy and he uh, will be on the way. It may sound easy, but he's a syndicate boss, folks. The rumors about him are scary. I poop my pants thinking about it. And Don Pianto is a uh, recluse. Just getting an audience with him will be difficult. Mario isn't even moving at all during that. He was just kind of standing there like, you fucking what? Yeah. I know the way! By that I mean I'm going here. Hello! Hi, my name is you Reggie and I like to power way. up the... I did... Yes. I want to power up this guy right here. He's strong. Look at him. Yes! <gasps> I could power up Flurry as well if I want to. Shazibi! <laughs> Shazubi! Scooby dooby doo. Beef up, bitch! Welcome to the meme zone. God, get me out of here! No, fuck you. <laughs> If we were members of a Scooby-Doo gang. <laughs> Cheekies. Zoics. Well, fine. Don't even fucking get me started on that. <laughs> we'll save that for another day. Oh, no. We will... Remind me later. <laughs> remind me later. A and I will share with you my opinions on freaking the Scooby-Doo gang. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yes. I get the feeling that Scooby-Doo is one of your triggers, like how Juju has his trigger. <laughs> Sorta, yeah. It's mainly Fred. Oh no. She's singling one of them out. <laughs> I'll have to remember it then. First things first. Gotta go see this bastard guy. Oh, uh, what happened to that blooper? Hey there, I'm Bluey, and this guy is a total liar! Don't listen to him. You heard his story, right? Well, he did try to throw me, but he completely tripped. And what happens? I end up landing in lava. Lava, man! Do you think that feels good? Thanks to him, you can stick a fork in me. I'm well... I'm well done! My pale skin's crispified. I'll never forget this guy. I'm gonna make him pay if it takes my whole lifetime. Jesus, Luigi. That's the only reason I'm still hanging around with him. You'll pay, Luigi. Uh, okay. Again, we'll do like a separate video where we're showing all the stories and I'll read through all of them. And I am going to be coughing up damn like no one's business by the end of it, probably. What kind of badges you got going on here? Do, 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 do. Hello. No, I, well, I, I do have one to sell though. Yes. Yes. That mouse looks familiar. I don't give a poop! All mice look familiar. Wait, that's being racist. Hang on. <laughs> okay, he doesn't really have any, anything special. Bye, lady! Oh, I was hoping to do that off this building. Who did? This guy also sells random mess. Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus, I have to. Oh, boy, this comes... 
I know. It allow me to spend all my money. <laughs> no, I don't want to buy anything else. I can't. Freeze! You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose my contact lens. I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move! You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch! Not an inch, you hear? Jump. Ah! Idiot! You stepped on it! My poor contact lens! I told you not to move! Don't you stupid ears work! What are you thinking? Uh, this is your fault. Now I have to buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it! Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy! Fine, if that's your plan, then here's mine, you wolf! I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens! Well, shit. I need a doctor! Eh, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Mm, wait just a moment. Gee, Phil, I'm sorry, but we don't have any in stock right now. Tough luck, I know. I can special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? Okie dokie, but in the meantime, I got stuff I need to store. Well, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I pay attention to half the things this guy tells me. Let's see what else I have that can store. Probably some end coupons. I'll just sell the rest. So I'm gonna use items. And I get the feeling I will have to sell some items just to pay for that damn content lens. Probably. There we go. While we're waiting for them to do that, I'm gonna go find out uh, how to beat this Don Pienta bastard. And I know just where to go to do that. E. Gotta go over here. Wait, did you ever catch that guy that took all your money? He's dead now. Did you get your 50 coins back? He's dead. Mm. How I got it back? I don't know if I did or not, but he's dead. <laughs> he, he, he's dead somewhere. I don't care. <laughs> you want something, Chop? <laughs> this is a Fortress of the Robo theme. You lost? Yeah, kind of, actually. <laughs> Where am I? Ooh, can I have that sword on the wall? <laughs> what business brings a Chop like you to a place like this? Mm. Say, it ain't vacation. What's that? You want to meet that lion cheat and steal and no good jerky for brains, Don Pienta? Real thieves like us in the poorest dirt, never catching a break because of that guy. Did you come here knowing all that? Kind of. And you know what scumbag demands protection money from us too, yeah? You know all that. And you still want us to tell you how you can meet that crumb? You see that guy in the background? I kicked his ass. He deserved it. Fine, Mr. Insensitive Jerk, but it'll cost you 64 coins! And no budget on the price, not a single coin. Inside info is privacy, then's the breaks! Okay, I'll pay. You'll pay? Really? Yeah, you heard me. You don't have enough cash, you already cheat! You can't pull it fast from the snail. Please come back after you knock over the bunker or something. I did dokie dokie. How much money do I have? Well, it looks like I'm gonna go on a murder spree. Again, uh, you can get 50 coins by going and catching that uh, jerk bag that took your money. I'm gonna kick his ass. I'm gonna kick his ass. Oh wait, I could do a couple of jobs too if I never find them. So I got the help center's thing. Oh, hello. Hey, value customer, your content lens is in. Please drop by our shop. Well, if you get out of the way. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. I'll give it to her later. Right now I gotta get the coins. Hey, 
Hey, bitch! Wait, I might need Vivian for that. But I can just do a couple of those jobs. Dang. Yeah. Or I think at least one of them should give me enough money. Well, I never use these. Yeah, you really don't. Let's see how much you can get for these. I'm here to sell you everything I have. Take my hat. Well, shit. God dang it, boy! <laughs> Ow! Oh, <laughs> Alright then. I gave him all my money and I'm gonna beat someone's ass like you! I'm here to do some jobs! Oh boy! Oh Jesus! They call me Garf, I lost my key and this cannot get into my house. Oh! Mm-hmm. Yes! Oakley dokley! Isn't that the guy I kicked whose ass I kicked? You took all my trouble, you? Okay, then please find the key and be quick about it. If someone else finds my key, they'll be able to get to my house, and I so I'll stand guard. I think I dropped my key when I went to the bad shop, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure too. I'm not sure that you lost a few brain cells after I, you know, beat them out of your god dang skull. My god, you piece of crap! Oh boy, bad shop. Oh Jesus, what the hell he was doing there? Was he wanting the rematch? I don't know. Maybe I should show off my own badge collection. Let him just get Wait, a. Isn't his name Garf? His name is Bitchface McGee, for all I care. Yeah, the guy who who whose ass you kicked was Gus. <laughs> Looks like I was indirectly being racist. Ooh. Oh well. He's probably a jerk too. Probably. Where were Gus is? He probably jumped in the river. Here's your key. Did you find my key? No. Yes. No. Woo! Damn it, I probably shouldn't have done this to begin with. Fucking hell. You solved the trouble. I don't care. I got monies. Let's go pay that jerk bag for his freaking info. Because, damn it, boy. Oh my god, that was disorienting. Just a little bit. Hey, jackass. <laughs> yeah. Take my money, you bastard. Yes! I mean, good call. You're a shrewd businessman. 64 coins on the nose. I get the feeling there's a reference in there. Okay, Nintendo the... 64. Oh! Okay, the Glenn knows the ears out and listen here. Nah. There's a parlor in the west side of the town that's run by a worm. Don Pignetta. Go to the store next to the parlor. Buy a dried shroom and a dizzy dial. Make sure you buy them in that order. Dried shroom, dizzy doll. You got that? No. You do that and the shopkeeper's gonna ask you what your favorite color is. You answered yellow. You got that? Not green, not blue, yellow. You hear me? But it is green. You bet. You want me to lie? I'm not moving at all again. I'm just completely just like... <laughs> my Mario.exe has stopped working. <laughs> See, yellow is the password for getting into Don Scumbag's oh-so-comfy office. You got all that? Sure. Well now. That's too bad. <laughs> Be out. <laughs> hey, there she is. We're gonna go do your favorite chapter. It is my favorite chapter. Yeah. Alright, angry, cranky, crazy lady, here's your... Yep. Did you bring me my contact lens, Mr. Squishy? Here you go. My contact lens! Oh, sweet relief, thank you! 
Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see. Oh, I'm so happy. You don't look happy. You still look pissed. Be careful from now on. People don't generally like having their stuff stumped on. And we're going to end that right here, ladies and gentlemen. Leave a like, subscribe if you want more poop like this. Anything you want to add into? I'm Batman. And as always, stay salty, everyone. Bye.